New tonight, a missing envelope is raising questions about whether the state followed the law when it recently sent out absentee ballots. It impacts a lot of Georgians. Half a million voters have gotten absentee ballots for this year's primary so far. And Doug Richards takes a closer look for us tonight. Rather than crowd into election precincts, the state has encouraged Georgia voters to submit paperwork to receive absentee ballots, and a half million voters have done it. We've put together something in six weeks that takes many states six to eight years. But to do it, they changed the absentee ballot package just enough to raise some eyebrows. Earlier this year, absentee ballots came in a package that included a ballot, an instruction sheet, and an envelope into which the ballot must be enclosed, plus a mailing envelope. The voter would stuff the white envelope containing the ballot into the yellow envelope that would then get mailed to the local election office. But now the state is no longer sending out this inner envelope to help automate the process, says Gabriel Sterling of the Secretary of State's office. The reality is, is there's no, no substantive difference in what's happening now than what has previously happened other than the volume. And in automating the process, we moved from an envelope to a sleeve. Is the sleeve sealable? It's not. But the sleeve violates state law, says attorney and Democratic State Representative Scott Holcomb. He points to the law that says the state shall provide two envelopes for each official absentee ballot. And we have a system that ensures the secrecy, the secrecy of the ballot. It's just that the Secretary of State, for some unknown reason, chose to violate the law and not follow it. State law appears to require two envelopes. Are you following the law? Uh, yeah, our attorneys feel that we are, we are meeting the specifications of the law, yes. However, instructions still tell absentee voters to return the two envelopes provided. Sterling says the state will send voters new instructions and change the instructions for upcoming ballots. 